Welcome to Analytics with Nux. In this video, we are going to see about what is union intersect except function in DAX. If you are from SQL background, you are familiar with these terms. These are nothing but set operation in DAX. Those who are not from SQL background, let us see what are those things. So basically, we have uh, two sets. Okay, so table. Consider these are the table, and you have these are uh, different values in a column. E G F H. So basically, these set operations are nothing but used to work on different sets. Okay, that is what it is. You in order to combine these two results um, with some kind of operations like union, intersect, except. That is what you are going to do. Uh, that is what basically uh, set operation is all about. So consider it is a column one and it contains E G F H as the value. And here this is another table or set which is having a value F H and M N. In order to combine the values in different way, like if you combine it using a union, you see here. So E G F H and F H. This is from this table and this F H from this table set. So you will get uh, combined together all values from both the tables. If you need, then you need to go for union operation. That is what it is all about. So basically, you are combining the values and what basis? Whether you want all to retain all values, then go for union. I do not want to combine all the values. Uh, I need to combine the table, but give me the common uh, data. So the common data between these two is nothing but F and H. So this is what intersect. So if you want a common data between two tables, then you need to go for intersect. In some cases, you have one list of entries and you do not want to get uh, the data which is available in set uh, two that is another table so in this case you want this set one information but do not show some of the records that is present in set two it is not in condition kind of so except you need to use so in this case e g and f h present in set two so ignore this you want the set of uh, this particular entry alone in that case you need to go for except so this is what is all about let us see it in demo. If you are new to this channel, hit the subscribe button right now to learn the concepts in Power BI. So we are in Power BI now. We already uh, seen uh, what is summarize function that will create a table. Now, today I want to give some scenario like uh, to explain the union. So uh, I want the products of um, in particular location i have you if you are following my channel you are familiar with um, the locations uh, chennai bangalore and um, hyderabad uh, is my sales location in this um, youtube channel i mean the business the naga garments business so one table contains the maximum sales amount of uh, chennai location and I need to create another table with minimum sales amount in another location, say for example, Bangalore. And I want to merge these two results because how when you need to go for your union, so you cannot achieve it in a single calculation. So you need to have separate tables for based on different, uh, uh, I mean, uh, you, you, uh, you need to generate two different tables, then you need to combine it. In that cases only, you need to go for these operations. Let us see it in demo uh, how to achieve it. So I already have a measure here, uh, like I will basically uh, reuse this measure with some modification. So I'm planning to create a new table now and with filter as Chennai, okay? I do not want sum x, sum x will return single value. I want to create a table now. So summarize will generate a table. This table is nothing but table I mean summarize this is the table name and it will ask for a column to group by then the uh, the calculated column the aggregated value and the alias name for it okay this is what the summarize will do in this i want to do a small modification in chennai i want the maximum sales amount okay sales amount uh, so to do that i will start with filter filter this table i mean instead of giving the entire table i will give the filter table as input to the um, summarize function so filter sales 
and uh, followed by um, the location okay the location equal to Chennai okay there you go so this filtered table is inputted to summarize function and from that I will take a product name as a group by column then I will get the maximum sales amount this is one of my output let's see uh, this is not um, what what it says uh, sales amount in table sales cannot be found uh, oh sorry this is not the actual uh, uh, column this should be the actual column and i will rename it as chennai okay max sales there you go so this will create me a new table here right so let us see the data this is fine now i want to create a similar table with minimum of uh, sales from a bangalore okay there is two tables this may be a requirement this is a hard requirement but it, it just try to understand the concept this may not be the usual uh, case okay just i want to create a new table now with minimum in um, minimum sales amount in bangalore okay minimum sales amount in bangalore that will not come it's a data that's it okay this should be Bangalore come on Bangalore minimum sales okay so basically in order to analyze you need to combine it with a single table because if you have a data in different tables the querying part as you know it should the same measure because I want to analyze this particular measure right so in that case I need to combine these two tables Chennai with maximum sales Bangalore with minimum sales into a single table in this cases you go for set operations let us try to uh, combine these two results let us see quickly the Bangalore results so now this is the Bangalore result and here the it is the Chennai results okay now I want to combine these two results okay for that i will create another table with union okay union union of just as simple as that chennai sales comma bangalore sales okay that's that's it so when i hit enter what it does see these are the records for um, uh, Chennai and these are the records for Bangalore okay it combined everything so that is what you will get a new result here that is Union uh, maybe I will replace it with the set operation okay hit enter so when I uh, from first table there are around uh, some six uh, six three six and ten records and Bangalore it contains same kind of uh, ten records six and uh, uh, ten records in union operation what you can see is here like you have 20 records over here okay that is a key difference I mean uh, that is what I'm trying to explain you want to combine the data using this union so and what does uh, this intersect will do so you see here these are the result set from two um, data set and intersect which will get the common I mean to say in Chennai also it should return same value and uh, here I mean in Bangalore also it should return same value that is both the columns I, I here I explained with only single column right here the both the results should be common okay so let us put that one intersect so when I do intersect so jeans lega and shirt are common in both Chennai and um, Bangalore with the, in Chennai jeans lega is thousand is the maximum value but in Bangalore Chennai lega is the minimum value okay so let us uh, revert back I, I will quickly see those two entries jeans lega in Chennai this is thousand jeans lega this is from Bangalore so both have same value but this is the maximum this is the minimum so when you want to combine and intersect it 
okay so in this case uh, you are comparing some some location something is maximum and some location something is minimum okay these kind of operations or analytics also you can do for this it will be very beneficial uh, and finally I want to show the except so except is nothing but uh, some cases like um, you can put vice versa that will give uh, I mean in, in except what it says like in genes Lewis this is your uh, value like 3300 this value does not exist in Bangalore okay that is obvious correct right so that is why it is uh, uh, whatever values you see here this is uh, coming over here okay I hope uh, you guys uh, understand and like uh, this video I mean um, uh, understand the concept uh, behind the set operations union and uh, intersect and accept operation okay if you like this video do subscribe to this channel and comment below for queries and do remember that data is your asset